Hey guys, so I'm coming on today because I'm going to work today. It is my day off. I'm going to do my nephew's hair because uh, he's my nephew, my cousin, and if he needs his hair done on my day off, that's totally fine. But um, if you guys notice, my face probably looks super different. Well, I just cut my hair today. It's so weird. Now that it's short, I feel like it gets so long. Like it puts everything into perspective for you when you cut your hair short because it's like so long I was like this morning I was like I gotta cut my hair like it's crazy but anyway um the whole reason why I'm coming on is because my makeup is a little bit different today and I want to talk about why it's different before I begin with that I want to say if you're watching this on my Instagram stories I love you guys thank you guys so so much you guys are awesome if you're watching this on YouTube I also love you guys and I'm really sorry that it is filming this way and not full screen which I'm sure you guys would probably much rather but anyway I have been using a new skincare line I don't want to talk about it yet um but the whole reason why I don't have face makeup on is because I love the way my skin has been feeling I don't even have concealer on so this is literally mascara fake lashes as you can tell this one's a little wonky and eyeliner that's all I have on oh and I did my brows like obviously I covered up my brows but there's not a drop of concealer not on my lids not under here. I mean, I still got my bags, but like, I'm actually really happy with it. And so I had asked you guys a while ago, probably maybe on YouTube, um, when I do my little makeup tutorials with my eyeshadow, I was like, do you guys want it? Cause I never do like my skincare routine, like ever. Um, so I wanted to know if you guys want to see a skincare routine, um, just to kind of let your face breathe a little bit, especially that we're wearing masks all the time. Um, nobody wants pimples. And um, in my other video, I had like pimples on my forehead. And now that I'm using the skincare line, like it's gone. I just wanna like let my skin breathe. Now don't get me wrong. Um, when I go out in the sun, I wear sunblock. Call me a baby, call me a wang. I wear sunblock. I always wear sunblock, um, especially on my face because I hate burning. I hate it. I would like to know one person who one person who doesn't like burning. I think I was talking too soon on that one. Val, if you're watching, you're gonna message me and be like, you always cut yourself off when you're talking. And I'm gonna be like, yeah, I know, cause I'm not perfect. But anyway, um, yeah, so if you guys want to see my skincare that I've been using, um, just see like the whole regimen that I've been doing and let me, let me know, yeah, let me know. And that's about it. So um, try to get used to seeing me like this. No concealer for my bags, no foundation, no, tinted moisturizer no nothing um just you know my face lotion and stuff like that and then when I go out in the sun obviously I put on SPF but that's it so if you guys want to see the actual products let me know all right I'll talk to you guys later bye all right so I just got to work the dryer's on so you guys can hear my lashes are like boom 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 uh I want to come on because my sister is usually like seven hours early and I'm like usually fashionably late, maybe a little bit more than that, but like not when I come to work or like if I know my clients are always early, I try to get here early because like whatever. I mean, if you're my first client of the day, I'll try to get here early, but like if you're not my first client of the day, like you gotta wait in the car, sorry guys. Uh, COVID rules. Um, but anyway, so I wanted to get here a little early because she's coming in and I feel like she's gonna be here early. I wanna show you guys my outfit of the day and I wanna talk about how funny I think it is that my sister and I are so different. We're so different. She just texted me saying that she's gonna be here at 140 instead of 130, so she's late and I'm not. <laughs> so here's my outfit of the day. I'm feeling very emo today, cause you know like, first of all, this is like from sitting in the car, I have like whatever. Um, my pants are from my sister. My shoes are my outdoor like shoes that I wear like in the backyard when I have to like go yell at the dogs and tell them to come in. And my shirt again is like an Amazon, you know, like $5 shirt, $3 shirt. Um, but yeah, I feel emo because it's like these are like loose on me. Like if they were tighter, <sighs> but they're not, they're loose. So, anyway, my dryer's going nuts. Oh, hey, I can see myself on the bike. <laughs> um, so I was thinking how different my sister and I are that like I'm always late, she's always early, and like that's just the way the world is. Okay, my stomach looks horrible like this. I love seeing, um, like trainers and stuff like that. Like, I follow like a lot of like I shouldn't record like that because when I put this on YouTube, you're only gonna see like here up. I look like the opposite of the guy from um, Home Improvements, the neighbor, how you only see like this up. In my videos, you see like this down. It's, it's ridiculous. I'm not even sure I can deal with that sound. So I feel like I might need to go outside for a minute and so I don't have to deal with that sound and I'll record outside. Um, I'm gonna go out to the front. So anyway, um, 
holy moly it is hot out um holy crap it's so hot so anyway my sister and i are very different um and i think it's so funny because um like i said i'm always late she's always early and i remember um we used to hang out all the time so like in our 20s we were like always together and people always thought we were twins like even like my, my mother-in-law before she actually met me when she just like knew her son was dating me. I can't sit. I'm too, I'm too ADD to sit. Um, she, she was like, oh, I thought that you guys were um, twins before I met you. Wow, it's so sunny. I should have brought my sunglasses. And, um, and it's like, no, she's actually like four years older than me. Um, so I don't really know what that says about me. <laughs> But anyway, so um, when we used to go out to bars and like people would like whatever, everybody thought that we were twins because we looked very similar, but we're so, so, so different in personality. And I remember one time we went to this bar and this guy was like, oh, and he, I have to like make sure that the top of my head is in this so that it doesn't get cut off in my YouTube video. Um, he was like, oh, he said to me, he's like, you're the extrovert and she's the introvert. And we were like, no, we're the opposite. Like, I can't be out here anymore. It's too hot. What was I thinking? Time out. I'm gonna get back to the story in a second. Wow, I'm sweating. Significantly cooler. I feel like a human now. Um, so anyway, so um, we were like, no, like I'm actually, do you hear the dryer? I'm gonna shut it off. This video is getting ridiculous. Okay, so I didn't shut it off and I wanna get back to what I was saying about my stomach looking really bad when I sit and how I follow trainers and they'll always post pictures of like, if I pose like this, my body looks great. If I pose like this, my body doesn't look as great. And I love that because I feel like I love transparency because it doesn't have us set our standards for something that's unrealistic or for us to constantly hate ourselves because we don't look as good as a trainer looks in a posed picture. Um, so I love that. So that's what I want to say before and I totally got sidetracked, went outside, was dying, came back in. This video is nuts. But anyway, so we were like, no, actually my sister is more of an extrovert and I'm more of an introvert. And um, it's funny because I feel like a lot of people don't know that about me because if I like you or if I'm comfortable around you, even if I'm not like 100% with you, but like I'm comfortable enough with you, sorry, that's horrible, but it's the truth. Um, you might think that I am an extrovert. Like I am like out there and like whatever, but like I'm so not. And I think it comes with being um, weirdly insecure as a kid of like who remembers me and who doesn't because when you're not the oldest this is the second time I'm talking about this which is so funny but when you're the youngest like I am um I was always referred to as like so-and-so's little sister so I was either like Derek's little sister or Tara's little sister I was never like an individual I was never like oh you're Erica so also on top of that I've changed my look nine billion times throughout my life and so I always feel like at family events, like I won't go over to somebody and say hi if they're like extended family, only if they're like immediate family and I know that they know me, I'll say hi. Otherwise it probably seems so rude and I'm not trying to be rude, but it's just my anxiety of like, I don't know if they know who I am. I don't know if they think I'm like Tara's little sister or who is this bald girl coming up to me? Like, who are you? So that's just like, I'm not, in that way, I'm so not an extrovert. I am, I mean, I'm so, yeah, I'm so, I'm so an introvert because I'm very, um, I'll never be the one to be like, whatever, unless, unless like, it's funny. Cause if I'm at like a store or if I like see somebody and I want to compliment somebody, I'll, I have no problems being like, hi, I love your hair or hi, you're so beautiful. Or, oh my God, whatever. Like I'll compliment people. I'll be nice to people, but I'm never to be like, hi, how are you? And pretend that people know me if they don't really know me or to not know if they really know me and put somebody on the spot like that. And I think from being introverted for so long in my life that I sat back and observed people and I feel like it makes me even more introverted in that way because like I see how awkward these situations are or these interactions are and I don't want to be a part of it. So anyway, I think that's pretty much what I want to say. How like my sister, if you meet her, like I feel like she also has like a wider group of friends. Like I have like a very like, these are my friends. These are my friends. And my sister is more like has many different friends and I'm not like that. Um, not that I'm not like trusting, but I just don't like put my energy into like a lot of other things. I just kind of put my energy into like a few people. Um, but I like, I love everybody. I mean, my clients are my friends. I mean, if I don't see you outside of the salon, like, you know, whatever, but like you guys come here, you talk to me, like I know your lives. I know what vacations are going on. I know about your family dynamics. I know about like literally everything. So like, yes, of course you guys are my friends, but like my best friends are like my like small little group of like people who equally know my life or you know stuff like that it kind of reminds me of the post malong song where, where he's like you know my uncles and my aunts though like those are my friends like the ones who like know my extended family and my extended family knows
Anyway, this was one of the most difficult videos I've ever filmed in my life. Um, not for content reason, but because I could not figure out what to do with myself between the dryer and me sweating and being emo and um, trying not to have my head cut off in this video when I put it on YouTube. That's the story. So anyway, um, again, no nothing on my face. And I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um, I did do like a really like bad hack job on my eyeliner today. Can you guys check this out? Like it just stops. I was like, mm -hmm. Because sometimes lashes look a little wonky on your eyes if you don't have eyeliner. If like, okay, not if you have good lashes and not if you do good lashes. Um, I do really good lashes, but I reuse my lashes like 10,000 times because I'm cheap. I'm not on you guys, on myself. Like I reuse my stuff on myself all the time. So like I'll take these off and I have like a little case that I keep all my lashes in. So after a while, the bands get a little wonky and like they're just not that good. And so personally, I have to like do what I got to do with my eyeliner to make sure that my lashes don't look so bad. Don't worry on you guys, I don't reuse things. Um, it is one and done. You guys take them home with you. I don't reuse lashes on you guys. It's just for my own personal collection. And plus I always feel guilty for spending money on myself. Like that's why I'm like, my shirt was $3 and my pants were free. <laughs> and my shoes I think were $2 from like Old Navy, um, which I probably got cheaper because Old Navy always does deals. Um, yeah, so I don't like to spend money on myself. So when I get eyelashes or products in my possession, I like to use them till the end. So anyway, I wonder if somebody analyzed these videos, what they would think. They'd be like, that girl is whacked. But anyway, I love you guys. I'm going to get going because I have to get changed. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Just rewatched the video and had to say, um, I say Post Malone. So weird. I'm like, it sounded like I had a, a mini stroke halfway through. I was like, Post Malone. <laughs> I had to say that. Um, I feel like there was something else I wanted to say. What was it? Mm, I don't remember. Um, oh, that was it. I've had people come up to me like um, in life and be like, oh, you're Erica with a K, blah, blah, blah. And like, I will be so nice to you. Like I carry that with me for life. Like, so please don't think because I'm saying I'm introverted that I'm like, don't come up to me and say hi. Like, no, if you're nice to me, I am so beyond nice to you. Like, I love people who are nice. Um, I'm just a little bit more, you know, reserved for people who, who I'm not sure. Who well, I'm not sure. But if you come up to me, if you, know, if you recognize me out, 100% um, please do come up to me and say hi. I would, I would love it forever. Um, and that, that's it for real now. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I'm ready for work. So what do I even need to wear face makeup for? People, I'm telling you. Bye.